How's it going guys? My name is Jevin and today we're going to be taking a look at another sling. This is the Hex Camera Sling Mini. Let's dive in. Okay, so the Hex Camera Sling Mini. Um, I've had this thing for about a year and a half. I've uh, been using it kind of off and on between my backpack and uh, this thing. This is kind of like run and gun when uh, you just want the most minimal amount of, of stuff to bring with you. Uh, this thing is my go-to. It has a decent amount of zippers and organization, uh, internal organization, and um, the straps are, are fairly easy to use. I would say compared to some other uh, slings, the straps are um, a bit more difficult. They're set up a little bit differently. Like they have these traditional style clasps and adjusters here on both sides rather than just having like pull straps like some other slings that you might see. Um, it's got these little adjusters here on the outside on both sides. This buckle actually on this side actually broke. And so I just threw a little strap keeper on here to keep the strap in place. Not a massive deal, but it is kind of a bummer that the uh, hardware failed. Their website doesn't really specify um, what type of hardware they're using, like if it's Duraflex or whatever. Um, that being said, these are YKK zippers with um, metal poles, custom metal poles. They work pretty good. Um, not bad. The material is a premium water resistant 900D poly, and this is the Glacier Camo colorway. Um, it's got a, a bit of green in it and kind of some charcoal gray. Um, it's kind of cool, kind of a different type of camo. I'm into it. It also has these straps on the bottom. Can I see those? This is actually um, big enough to strap like a full size tripod, like my 74 inch, um, I think it's 74, 73 or 74 inch small rig tripod. I was able to fold up, fold down to its smallest um, setting and slide it in here, strap it down and hop on the e-bike and go shoot. Um, I've been using this a lot for my buddy's uh, video podcast that I've been helping him out with. Shout out to Sammy at Dream Big Jobs. Check him out on, on YouTube as well. He has a rad uh, um, video podcast where he inter interviews owners of restaurants and entrepreneurs and stuff like that. So make sure to check that out. I'll actually put a link down below um, if you're into that sort of thing. But uh, yeah, so let's, let's dive into the inside of this thing. Um, it's got a decent amount of space. Right now I've just got these Comica um, wireless microphones in there. I've got some AirPods and then it's got this other front zipper right here. Kind of not a massive zipper, but just enough to fit your iPhone. So that'll slide right in there and it'll zip up. No problem. This top zipper, I pretty much just use for some cables, um, but this zipper works pretty well. I've got like my SD card adapter and a USB-C cable and, you know, random stuff that you're gonna need at some point. In this zipper, which is sort of in the front here, I keep a bunch of other random stuff. So, um, dead mice for the, for the microphones, I've got my little, uh, I think this is just my one terabyte SSD SanDisk drive. Um, a spare battery fits in here. You could fit, you could fit two or three spare batteries just in that one pocket right there actually. Um, lens cap, it even has a, uh, a key keeper and it's removable. So you can, I can do this with one hand pop that off, take your keys, or if you want to hook something else to that, that'll work. Slides right back in and boom, you're good to go. Let's see, so there is one, two, three 
mesh pockets inside of there. Then two of the poly um, pockets there that are stitched. And then this thing um, can fold down when there's nothing in it. It'll get pretty thin. It's pretty packable. You can chuck this in a backpack and let it rip. So this thing will also hold my Sony ZV-E10 with the standard lens on it with a small rig cage. Uh, and I can also fit a Rode VideoMic Pro. It'll fit right in there, no problem. The, the foam on the Rode mic, you know, smashes down a little bit, but it's not a massive deal. Or you can fit the Sony zv 10 with the small rig cage and these Comica uh, microphones. That'll fit in there as well. And then of course the tripod on the bottom. So, you know, for a run and gun little setup, trying to keep things super simple, this is a great sling. It's comfortable, sits right on your back, no problem. It's even got a little um, flush handle right here, so it's easy to grab. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it with this thing. I dig it, year and a half. The only issue I've had is that one little buckle. Um, and again, that's not a massive deal. Another fun little feature this thing has, right here on this strap, there's a little hidden Velcro pocket. You could hide your SD card in there. And it's gone. So yeah, let me know if you guys have any questions. Love to answer them for you. Right now, this thing is going for $49.95 on Amazon. I've got a link below. I'd appreciate it if uh, you use that link because I get a little kickback from that if you use it and buy it. Um, but yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little clip. Please subscribe, like this video. I'd really appreciate that. Like I said, I'm releasing a video every week, so um, keep on the lookout. Hope you guys are all doing great, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.